Hey guys, Dustin the Pro Picker here. I'm headed over to a community sale. I still have a little bit of an issue with like a strained calf right now. So I'm gonna be walking a little bit slower. However, it's gotten to where I can at least stand on it and walk. So we're gonna see how many of these sales I can hit to find items to sell on eBay to make a profit. Let's get it. Yeah, she's not ready to be able to. That that's what I'd be into looking at. Yeah, the old stuff's like totally what I'm looking for. All right. Let me show you the golf club first. Yeah, absolutely. I wasn't even sure if I was gonna put these out. So are you moving out or moving in? Oh, we, this is like I saw the two minute truck. <laughs> yeah, we moved in last year. Oh, that's I totally understand. <laughs> so they're uh, the Mizuno. Mizuno uh, what are they? I forget what it is now. Yeah, MP32s. Okay. Uh, they they just need cleaned up. I haven't used them, uh, so I used to golf all the time, but I don't golf anymore. So. I was thinking about putting them out, but yeah, I don't know. It's just the the, the old Big Bertha. Yeah. It's nice. <laughs> Do you want the bag too, or just the clubs, or? Um. Well, what would you think with the bag? I don't know. I have no idea. What What would you want to pay for? That's a set of clubs. I mean, those are good clubs. I know that. 75 be cool. Yeah. Okay. Hell, why not? Okay. I'm not cool, using cool. them ever, so yeah, and, uh, I think that's fair. I take a look at the box of video games, uh, too, as well, actually. Okay. Let me go find that. So we, I was in the military and a government contractor for a long time. and Air Force or? Yeah. Okay. I did uh, four in the Army myself. Did you? So, nice. Yeah, yeah. So I did nine in the Air Force and okay. I was a contractor. They have, like, cool and it's got to be worth it. Yeah, I don't know. Can you come back tomorrow? Uh, yeah. Morning. How are you? I'm good. Yourself? I'm good. Oh, I'm a customer. He's coming out in a second, though. Hello, sir. Good morning. Good morning. How are you doing? Fine. You got any military stuff? I do. What you looking for? Anything related. Okay. Huh. Got a couple of uh, Kevlar helmets. How old are they? How old are they? Uh, let's see. This one's from Afghanistan, circa 2010, and this one is from Iraq, circa 2004. And then, uh, we grab these boxes here, I'll put them out there for you. I have a little kid's, uh, chem gear set up. <laughs> it's mostly just body armor stuff. If I took all three, I could do 50 of these. No, I couldn't do that. That's, they're pretty good. It's all old, old early stuff. Uh, it's like 2000s, it's yeah. not, not old stuff, oh, okay. not that old stuff. Okay. Mm -hmm. No problem. Um, what are you asking on the helmets and the body armor? Um, I hadn't really thought about it, to be honest with you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, Tools? No, I don't think I'm selling any tools. Sorry. The VCH. All kinds. Of things. I would need that. What would you think on those? Oh, I'd be alright. Yeah, for you. You can take whatever you want to give me for that, man. Make it a solid hundred, make it easy. Easy? Is that easy for you? Yeah, I'll do that. Yeah, yeah, that's totally fair. Hey guys, jumping in here real quick. I do want to mention that that same day he ends up texting me about some video games, and I end up going back there spending a 
significant chunk of money with him. And then I thought about it uh, later on after that, and I did send him some extra money for this purchase here. As a fellow veteran, I actually had a scenario where years ago, just to pay the bills, I kind of fire sold the vast majority of like my army stuff. And it's not like I need to necessarily have kept it all around. But you know, I wanted to make sure he was taken care of and stick around. So you'll be able to see all the crazy games I buy. I appreciate it. No problem. And uh, let me give you a hand with that table one before I leave too, just because. Did you want this thing too? What's that? Oh, I did. So uh, let me throw you an extra buck for that. <laughs> okay, thanks. There's uh, 101. All right. Which is you. Disney 101, 101 Dalmatians, all right? There you go. Thank you very much. Here, let me help you get at least, like, at least one table out here. Okay, hang on just a second. I have to go really slow though, because I messed up my calf. <laughs> so just letting you know. No problem. Hey, you want to go forward? That would probably be easier. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. I'm just lumpy McGee right now. <laughs> Inside, there's a set of ice skates. There'd be 20 on this, would you? 20 on the American doll? Uh huh. Sure. <laughs> My granddaughter loves them. <laughs> okay. All right, yeah, that's about the speed. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> no, you're good. It's perfect. I'm gonna go a little yeah, bit farther down. I figured you probably already have all this out, but you were looking for the game, so. <laughs> oh no, that's fine. I don't mind at all. So yeah, I'll look at it. Look through that stuff tonight. We can probably do like 10 bucks for the jacket. 10 bucks. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Get some of this stuff out here for you. I feel like it's the least I could do. Oh, you're good. Get a couple out for you. All right, awesome, thanks. All right, thank you. Yeah, just let me, oh yeah, the hay covers. Oh, there. good call. <laughs> well, thank you, yeah. <laughs> well, let me, yeah, just let me know about the games and, okay. uh, just, well, thank you, you have right. a good one. Thank you, you too. Appreciate hey, it. how you doing? Hey, pretty good yourself? Got that GoPro going? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Hi, good morning. All right, got a little bit of everything out so far. I haven't, What do you have on this stuff? It's all a dollar. Oh, okay. And like these? Um, I haven't even looked yet. So oh, okay. Curling iron, or blow dryer curling iron, probably going to go for about 10. Okay, that's... And the curlers are probably going to be about 3. No idea. I just keep grabbing random stickers and. <laughs> gotcha. That's right. I'll just make a little pile. You can total me up and we'll <laughs> see it figure it out. Be out of my house because I don't look at any of it anymore. No, I get it. I don't store it anymore. Oh, there's some more stuff over here. Yeah. 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 Oh, I bet, yeah. I came up, like, um, and then somebody was already coming up here and you just, like, pulled out your first thing and I was like, oh, give her time to set up. <laughs> yeah, I, mean, I still have one in the house. I'll be bringing out during the day. Oh, okay. Haven't uh, got it all set up yet. Yeah, I think I'll be doing that tomorrow. Okay. Looks like a lot of this you didn't get a chance to use. Yeah, that's really, it's Christmas presents, birthday oh, presents. Oh yeah. 
stuff that just goes right into the closet. And I tell people not to get me anything. They get me something. I can't keep on um, taking stuff. And then I go back around right the way. So it's just piled up in my closet. Stuff, do you? Um, I have just a wedding. Uh, it's my pile. Oh, okay. no, sorry. You're, no, you're fine. <laughs> sorry. I was going to look see what the box was. Uh, Maybe just a box or something. That's that. Facial it's a facial massager. massager. Gotcha. Yeah, yeah. Vegan soup. That'd be 20. Yep. yep. There you go. Even the top. This one. Right. I'm not what I mean. 13. Yeah, two and five. Yep. Right. Here's 20 for you. All right. Well, thank you very much. Thank you. You have a great day. Yeah, you too. Oh, limpy. Hello. Hi. How are you? Good. How are you? Uh, pretty good. Flat swim. Flat swim. So this is from the neighbors. Fifteen's really good on that. No. <laughs> I was like, I did not want every single one of these oh, to dump no, out. No, I wasn't anticipating it being That gravity. Um, I'm gonna take this. Okay. So that's fifteen to so twenty-one. Yep. All right, awesome. You don't have any more video game stuff you were thinking about pulling out, do you? Uh, I might. I can get a look. I'll be right out. I'd hang out for a second and take a look, yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I knew once they started seeing cash flow, all of a sudden, other things would be Did you want three on this, too? Um, I don't know. What if I bump it up to five for you? Yeah, that's fine. All right. Okay. I'm not going to take those, but I appreciate you uh, bringing those out. So and... that would be $11. Well, I paid her the six already on okay, those. So it's... Yeah, that's the five, yeah. <laughs> I take one back in and I end up getting more than I intend. Oh. And then... There you go. Cool. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank, Thank you. you. All right, guys, that sale didn't necessarily work out as well as I would have hoped. So the Samsung was missing some speakers. I didn't, even, I wasn't even thinking it was just something I overlooked. However, that unit does go for around 60-ish plus shipping, just without the remote, just the unit alone. So we'll still do okay on that. Thank you. You too. Three sales so far, four sales so far. Three of them have had awesome stuff. This is going great. I don't know how much longer I'm gonna make it with my leg being how it is, but I'm gonna pull up here and hit the next sale and we'll see what we find. Let's get it, guys. What's orange? Oh, I I put out the clothes at a dollar. Oh, okay. I was gonna start color coding. Yeah, and then okay. I, up with it pretty quick. So I, <laughs> I was like, done. This is more than I need to tackle. Yes. I gotta get that for a buck. Did I give you any of the shapes? 
Yeah. The SpongeBob. I'm an original gamer. Yes. I take it video games are pretty <laughs> popular right now. They are. Have you been asked by others? Yeah. Yeah, I bet. I mean, that's that's what everybody's looking for. Who's that guy? Oh, Is this a Call of Duty shirt? Yes. I actually really like this one. This Call of Duty. Oh, is this into this is from uh, Team Fortress too? Free to good home. Doesn't even have to be a good home. That's interesting. Chris. Is that Carl Cole? Where was the extension for? Did I hand it? It was right there. Oops. All right, I think I'm ready here. Okay. <laughs> Got that. And these. $19. All right. Hello. Hi, how are you? Oh, pretty good. Yourself? What do you have on the shoes? What? How much you have on the shoes? It's just making offer. Okay. A couple bucks do on these? Yeah, whatever you want. All right. Like What's your name? This is Tatum. Tatum? He loves people. <laughs> There you go. Perfect. Thank cool. you so much. Thank you. Have a good one. Yeah, you too. Good luck today. Thanks. <laughs> Hello. Hi, how are you? Oh, good. Yourself? Did you guys put down you your tree on me? I did. Right. What do you have on your tree? Ten. Ten. It does work. It's missing mm -hmm. some of the, you know, pieces. The bulbs. Or the, well, not even bulbs. The... Yeah, the little lights. Yeah. Yeah. I'll wait. I'll look in my house. And I'll... Just double check. I didn't see any chips. Looks good. Oh, um, I'm sorry. I noticed a chip there. I'm probably going to pass. I'm sorry. Oh, okay. My, my bad. Sorry to have you dig it for a box. I'll just try. I think it's right here. I don't think I knew there was a chip on it. Right. Yeah, I bet the chip got the wrong way around. Yeah. <laughs> You want the ukulele? Yeah, I want to do it. <laughs> He's off with you though. Okay, thanks. Cool, yeah, thank you very much. You have a great day. You too, thanks. Whew. How's it going? Good, how are you? Uh, not bad. Transfer key. 
and then make a little pile if that's okay. Yeah, for sure. If you want to just. And yeah. then you shoot me a price and we'll figure it yeah. out. Yeah, definitely. Switch carry for the TS. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah, just uh, uh, okay. Cut me a little deal by just buy the rest of the yeah. cases. Yeah. Cool. I don't know. How's it going? Good. You don't have anything else to this? I don't. It's literally just oh, that. It's okay. untested. I'd give it to you for a couple bucks. All right. What do you think here total? Um, Would you do 20 for all that? Yeah, that's actually the number I had in my head, so that cool. works. I got one more thing for you. If you watch everything for me, I got Okay, one. I gotcha. Excited guy. Oh, murder all day. Actually watch you on YouTube. Oh, do you? Yeah, we've traded before. <laughs> oh, we've okay, before. I'm sorry. Yeah. No, you're good, well, you're yeah, good. Yeah. What's your name again? Daniel. Daniel Dustin, yeah. okay. Yeah, yeah. We, we <laughs> traded a couple years back down by the Dayton Mall. Oh, yeah. I do remember near the PetSmart like, or whatever. Yeah, yeah. 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 Those are hard to open, but they're oh, yeah, they are hard to open. That's a clean one, too. What'd you want on this? 15. 15? That's they're going bad. for about 30, 35. <laughs> <laughs> Got a dollar for you. All right. Cool. Thank you guys. Good Thanks. luck today. Sure. Oh, am I? Yeah. Nice. Are you gonna frame it? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Twenty. Right. It's in pretty good shape. You don't have any clubs for sale, do you? Yes, I do. Oh, you do? Okay, I take uh, a look. Well, let me go down and get that. I have my wife stay here for a second. Okay, yeah, absolutely. I'll look around. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> I will stay here for a second. At 8.30 and people were already driving around the neighborhood. I'm going to buy this. Uh, oh. Jeez. <laughs> if I can get it up to you. Know. Um, is it okay if I just stir a little sure, pile? You do, you do you. All right, I'm going to stir a pile right here. Oh, I'll sorry. Oh, yeah, yeah. You're fine. Yeah, that's Oh, yeah, McGregor's. McGregor's, yeah. Okay. That's the whole set. These were my fitted clubs, so I don't know how they work. Yeah, all McGregor's. Okay. I give them to you for $10 if you want. Or yeah, I'll do that. You do that? Yep. Good. Yeah. That's totally uh, up my alley what I'm looking for. Yeah, I got a box of so Take the one. Can I give you a buck just for this pan? I know it sure. says both pans, but I, I just probably I might throw that away anyway. So probably don't want that one. Yeah, a buck's fine. Twenty-seven. Twenty-seven. All right, cool. Yeah. All right. There you go. Thirteen. All right, cool. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Much appreciated. I'm gonna have to make two or three trips. You're fine. Fine. 
to. Guys, I seriously was gonna call it a day. I was about to wrap up and everything, and I saw this sale that I hadn't been to yet, and I was just like, fine, one more sale, and it just goes to show you, totally worth it. That KitchenAid fixer right there was only $5. He went in, grabbed a whole iron set of McGregor's for me and sold them to me for 10 bucks, and then we had $2 on that Callaway bag. Just amazing, and it goes to show you, if you stay out, uh, you can definitely make some additional finds. I was more than content with everything I got and I threw it in the back of my Kia today and that was just like the cherry on top. What a great day. Oh. Hello. Can I set this up for her? Yes, you may. Thank you. That was me. <laughs> Sorry. This was kind of lost at first. So. Oh. I'm actually still looking. Is it okay if I just yeah, leave this here for right now? Yeah. I appreciate it. Grab mm. mowing for five bucks. We'll do one. So I didn't expect <laughs> to actually buy more. That was not the perennial yard sale on the street that I thought it was. But yeah, they had some pretty good stuff there. So I partook. Hey guys, here's the video game lot. As promised, I do want to share this with you guys. So I ended up with uh, all of this that you see here, plus a drum set and some guitars. Uh, there's three wireless guitars and they have their dongles which is amazing that's what you really want to see or two of them were wireless two one's wired and then one's a Wii guitar and then there's the drum set dongle there for the wireless drum set and yeah we're looking at a, a pretty good come up here so i spent 325 dollars on everything didn't haggle at all and i'm gonna go through some of the highlights here with you this is not going to count on the profit breakdown because I just, it's so time consuming to go through all of this just to build out the profit breakdown and then to go back through it and sell similar and list it all. So we're just going to go over some highlights here. But yeah, I think this was a pretty good pickup for 325. And this is why, I mean, other than the fact that, you know, being a decent human being and having conversation skills is nice, it helps to speak with people because you, you know, you never know what they have for sale. So I, here we go. We got Pokemon Sapphire here, so this is a really good one, guys. Obviously, Pokemon games are hot. There's another Pokemon game in here. There's only two Pokemon games. So I got Omega of Ruby for the 3DS. Obviously not as good as Sapphire, but still a pretty solid pickup there. Got some PSP here, but we'll get to that later. Again, have those dongles. Got a couple Rock Band mics, which is great. Uh, some PC games here. I have sold Spore before. And then Ham Ham Games, uh, Yu-Gi-Oh, Morio Advance, unfortunately, dramatic label wear there. Having a hard time seeing that. But yeah, uh, some, some alright games there. Sonic Colors on the DS. And then I think you guys probably noticed this pretty quick if you're really into like the retro gaming scene and stuff. So we've got a Game Boy Micro here. I put a game in it. 
So it's got Spyro in there. And yeah, it works completely, sound, uh, everything. So it is good to go. I did uh, test that out on site there just because, you know, pretty important part of the lot. Got this DS case here. The cases are kind of rough, but whatever. There's a Pelican 1060. That's for the PSP over there. Um, Animal Crossing, 3DS. I've got, I know the Smash Hits Metallica and the Warriors of Rock stuff is uh, better than the World Tour when it comes to the Guitar Heroes on the PS3. So there you see a 3DS box. That's actually this one right here. Uh, the box is a little rough, but I mean, it's there. So that's a definite bonus. Fully working with charger and everything. Uh, one of these two doesn't have a charger. It's either the DS or the DS Lite, but they both work. We've got a PSP here. He plugged it in for me, showed me it worked and everything. The battery's dead on it. That's super common on these. And we already have one ordered. And then this is a stack of PSP movies. So these are UMDs. And for anybody that doesn't know, they put movies out on this thing too. I'm probably just gonna lock this as one listing and just get rid of them that way. Uh, I don't know. I know some of them are starting to get a little bit more collectible. And we've got the uh, PlayStation Move controllers here with the, uh, what, navigators, right? Yeah, yeah, the navigation controllers. So overall, I think a really awesome lot. I didn't haggle him or anything. He was really good to me earlier. In fact, you know, from that purchase, I sent him a little bit extra. And yeah, overall, just uh, really happy with how it went. It was super nice to meet him and his family. And uh, yeah, really excited to get this stuff listed. All right, I'm gonna do a profit breakdown again for you guys. Why I kind of started going away from doing those is because it's very hard to accurately portray how this actually works. So if you don't have a reselling business or even like a business in general, don't blame you, most people don't. And the thing is when I purchase all this stuff, it takes a lot of time, energy, and effort to get it listed on eBay. And just simply the act of listing it on eBay does not guarantee that it's actually going to sell for what I ask for, or even close, or sell ever. It's just how it is. And I just wanna make clear, this isn't like some kind of like ATM machine. I go to garage sales and then all of a sudden, it's like, bam, I'm hit with money. It, it's just not how it works. There's definitely a sales cycle. There's slow times of year. So this is like the time of year where buying is a big deal. Like I, I'm getting as much it thrown at me as I can handle, if not more, definitely more. But it's also the slowdown time of year. Add on to it $5 plus gas. And, you know, people are less likely to spend money when they have less money. Unfortunately, you know, that results in a sales slump. So you end up like the stuff you see today. I'm going to sell it. It's just, it's going to sell over time. And I'm going to say probably through Q4 before I even have most of this sold. So the holiday season is going to have to beat, beat this up some. But we definitely got a lot of amazing high value items here. It's just a lot of work goes into processing, cleaning, testing, listing, customer service shipping the item out, taking returns, continuing the customer service experience, all of that. So dealing with negative feedbacks when those occur. So just putting that out there, uh, this is more, uh, instead of a profit breakdown, I'd say it's more of an optimal, ideal profit breakdown. If everything sold magically today, not how it actually is in the real world. So hope that helps, but we're gonna get into the breakdown here. So we have, $3,993.23 as our total list price. So that's what we're gonna list everything you see here today for. And we're gonna treat this as an exercise of, let's just say everything was free shipping. So that's with shipping baked into the price. So that means we have to deduct $686 for an estimated shipping expense since we're gonna have to cover that. We spent a total, and this is what I spent at the garage sales. Again, this does not include any of the video game stuff you just saw. 
$211, guys. So that's pretty awesome. And then we're looking at gas of $20 because I spent about that uh, driving around that day. Um, eBay fees. So we're going to be paying these fees uh, to eBay of roughly $598.98. And again, one thing I want to note, this is accounting for the fact that we no sales, no offers or anything like that, which is just not reality. We send out offers every day and we offer sales, especially on aging inventory. So we're looking at a total there uh, remaining of $2,000. $477.25. And then I'm going to go ahead and estimate a quarter of that to just disappear poof to the tax man. So that's going to be $619. And so we're looking at roughly $1,857.94 remaining, which is really awesome. But again, it's probably going to look less than that over time. And then you have to factor in all the time and effort we're going to put into making this Will we be making a good hourly rate? Yes, but it is definitely uh, work and definitely striving to have a high hourly rate, reward ourselves. And good days like this offset bad days, guys. So sometimes you go out, you don't find much, or sometimes you have 26 returns, to, maybe not 26 returns, but you have five returns to deal with all at once. You're not finding much, or you have sales slump days. So like days like this where you find a lot of awesome stuff, this is the upside of reselling. And there are obviously cons like there is with anything in life. I wanna thank everybody so much for watching today. Uh, this is a totally different video format. Let me know down below what you think about it. Kind of treat this as a special event from time to time I might do. And yeah, if you haven't already, please subscribe, turn on the bell notifications, Hit the like button on the way out, guys. Check me out on Instagram and Facebook, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.